I got some ear candy for you guys. I hope you like it. Ladies and gentlemen, check it out. Uh, what we've got here is our uh, armature that we had before, and I want to show you that when I was beating on it, the the welds kind of came loose. So you can see it; it's it's beat up pretty bad. Uh, you know, it's too bad. You know, I didn't do good, but I did get a hold of something that's called, you know, uncure. Okay, uh, this is uh, you know unglue kinda. It debonds glue, and I've been trying to debond this glue. And then I put, uh, I stuck a piece of wood in there to wedge it in there, and it's wedged in pretty good. Let's see. I'm just showing you guys what I'm doing, trying to get this stuff knocked out. I'm really hoping I can get this uh, debonded. So, ladies and gentlemen, I've come to the conclusion that I'm not getting this off very easily. And the best way to get it down is to sand it-ish. So I've got it on the lathe, and I don't want to particularly use the lathe to sand it down, but I do have something to sand off the magnets. I got some 40 grit sandpaper and an air compressor that'll knock this stuff down. And you can see that it, it, it rotates okay, but if I speed it up, it'll, it'll bounce a lot and probably fall off and bust the shaft uh, attachment to this. Uh, it's got two washers on the outside attached to, you know, this, you can see it damaged. Now this one was a busted one anyways. You can see how it's warped. Uh, even if I lined it up, I might try to line this back up to where it's balanced again and then uh, weld it. But you can see where the shaft is warped. The shaft's no good on this one. So what I want to do is get the magnets off of here without damaging the core because it's balanced. So that's what I'm talking about. So this is my dilemma, you know, we've got this magnet and it's got an iron core. Uh, I'm not sure how I'm going to be able to get these magnets off without breaking it. The, the you know, uncure appears to, you know, remove glue, right? I, I remove the glue with this easily and you know it it's not so easy on the other places but uh yeah i mean i've soaked it uh, several times so far with the uncure and i'm still you know trying to repurpose the uncure and i mean i'm not sure where to go with this um You know, maybe you guys can give me a hand on on any ideas to uh, get this uh, problem resolved. So, ladies and gentlemen, uh, what I've got here is uh, the same one you've seen on the film just a few minutes ago. It's not the one that's got the bent shaft. The one with the bent shaft is right here. Basically, I learned how to uh, get that stuff off. You just take something and just go at an angle, uh, something heavy at an angle, like a hammer, but you don't want to hit it straight on. You don't want to hit it straight on. You want to hold it like this and just hit it like this, like a hammer. I just knocked that piece off there. There's another little piece. It just flies off. So you want to have a helmet 
when you do it. This one's busted anyways, don't matter. Uh, because it's out of balance. I won't even try to re-weld it because it's out of balance because the shaft has been. But we got this one and uh, we've still got some glue on there. I've put that debonder stuff on there and the places that it got to, it did make it thinner and you know gunkier to get all easier to get off. <laughs> but the sandpaper's going, the sander's going to get that off. So now, now we can clean this up. We can get the, uh, the little bit of rust that's on there off. And we can, uh, we're gonna find some magnets now. Oh, there's a spot. So here on Ford, basically, I just need to get a couple of magnets. I think I need 18 of them. I'm going to try to get a hold of 20. That may give us the benefit of having a couple extra or, you know, whatnot. Uh, there's a possibility I could double it up if I got uh, three millimeter. But I would prefer to have like five or six millimeter from the factory. Eight millimeter is the maximum. I'm assuming that the edges will probably cause it to make it even harder. But it's cool. It's going to be fine. I hope you Looks guys like, we like got it. A core. We'll move forward. See you on the next video. Peace out. Hello, lazy to get gentlemen. Thanks for watching all the way to the end of the video. There's lots more content coming. Click the subscribe button below. Make sure you come back for more because there's great content always coming up every day in this channel. See you next time. Peace.